guys, what's up? My name is Olivia, welcome to my channel. Um, today I want to talk to you guys about my five favorite things that I love about New York City. So if you're thinking about moving to the city sometime soon or you know, you just love to hear videos about New York or you're trying to decide if New York is for you, I apologize for this video not being well organized. I'm just kind of winging it. I live in New York City, I live in downtown Manhattan and so I've lived in New York almost two years now. Wow. I've lived here for about almost two years. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, thought it was a good time to like share what I love about living here after living here for a while rather than just like coming here with my, you know, my little rose colored glasses when I first moved. Yeah, I was really in for a treat. <laughs> Nonetheless, I love New York so much and I'm so happy that I made the decision to move here when I was 18. It's the best, I wouldn't change it for anything. One of the, it's literally the best decision of my life. But yeah, so go ahead and subscribe and like the video and let's, let's do it, let's do it, okay. Okay, so one thing that I love about New York, I love the speed of the city. Right now we are going through a pandemic, if you're watching this from the future. The speed and the hustle of the city has definitely changed a bit. It's still here, you know, the New York, the energy's still here, it's just a little bit more different, I would say. It's a little different, but it's still here. You're still surrounded by beautiful architecture and history and New Yorkers, which I think are the best people. People say that they're mean, but I don't think that's, that's not true. That goes into my next point is the people that's actually another reason why i love new york is the people here obviously there's fake people everywhere i think that the people that i tend to find in new york are much more genuine than people in other cities they're a little bit more genuine they're more raw you know they're straight to the point they don't really like to fuck around and i appreciate that because i don't like to fuck around um, you know, we walk fast, we live a fast life. And everyone's so extra, but in a very fashionable way. I feel like if you go to other cities, it's a little bit more, like, chill. When I, like, when you, some people like to dress up and they're fashionable, but it's like that city's fashion. This is New York City fashion, so it's like real fashion. My third point is actually fashion. Um, that's actually one of the reasons that draw, drew me to the city is fashion. You know, I love clothes. I love designer. I love thrifting. I love, you know, unique pieces and looking at people's cool different styles while shopping in Soho or just walking around in Soho or anywhere downtown or just, I just love it. Um, the fashion here is crazy it's it's like one of those things where you walk outside and you see people in cool outfits and you're just so much more motivated to try new style dress up more and more consistently and put more effort into your outfits and i don't know it just it gives you such a great like confidence booster at least for me so i don't know i love it and i love to be inspired by everyone else that's here um even during all of this it's still it's still inspiring to see people because people are still creative here so yeah, shout out to you, New York. Okay, and the last one, the sun is like changing, guys. Sorry, we're using my window for lighting and it's January, so we're not really getting a lot. <laughs> my last one would probably be that, you know, it's New York. There's always something to do. Not these days. I mean, in a general way, pre-COVID life, um, there's just always so much to do here and that was always so much fun. You go to work and then you go hang out with some friends and then you're like, wait, let's go do something else. It's just like not a weird thing to be getting home at like 11 or 12 on like a weekday. Whereas I feel like other places, there's not much else to do unless it's like the weekend. Just the endless amount of shit that you can do here. It's like your whole, you can really be doing so many different things. You know what it is? It's not the amount. It's not like that you can be doing stuff at all times of the day, even like now in COVID, it's like you can't. It's more of like a, a variety thing. Like there's so many different stuff that you can do here. There's so many different cultures that come here and you know, make restaurants and make little bars or have little festivals and you know, it's just a, a whole different atmosphere. So many different people, like when I'm moving here, I got introduced to like a few different cultures that I've just well one never thought about or I just didn't even know that that culture was even like a thing because it's not completely broadcasted where I'm from I'm from California I don't know if I told you but yeah I'm kind of thirsty so I'm gonna take a little water break that was nice a variety of things you know you could be doing you could be eating authentic Greek food in Astoria and then you know next thing you know you're 
down eating Caribbean food in Brooklyn or something like that. You could just have so many different things and then you can go straight to like, you know, K-Town and there's, there's Korean or there's Chinese. Like, I mean, I feel like no Chinese is ever really like authentic Chinese. Like, I don't know. Anyways, and then you have New York pizza, which is my favorite. And then you can go down to Little Italy and have your beautiful Italian cuisine. Like it's everything you'd ever want and then more. Like I didn't even name like a lot of other things. Like there's a lot of other shit. Anyways, I don't want to talk your ear off. So I'm going to head out and yeah, I just want to keep this video really small. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, go ahead and like it and don't forget to subscribe. I also have a playlist for like more moving to New York stuff. Um, I call it the moving to New York starter pack. I'll leave it up here. I also make like you know nyc vlogs and stuff like that in college week in my life i'll also link that up here it's my living in new york city playlist i put everything in playlists so it's all simple and organized and you can watch what you want to watch and then you know go from there i'm gonna go thanks for watching i appreciate you have a great day enjoy winter winter sucks but i hope you guys do a face mask tonight and feel like a baddie because you're a baddie and we all need to be baddies so i love you take care peace out bye <laughs> Oh,